Good day and welcome back to another DB Legends video. In this video we are going to be taking a look at the, well, we're going to be taking a look at the hard difficulty of the full power battle. So, obviously I'm showing you guys the units and the equipment on the screen. A uh, little change up is obviously we've now, well, not so little, but we do have the Super Saiyan Goku. Uh, basically in his slot you should just use whichever summonable unit you have. If you're going to use the Bardock that I was using from the normal difficulty, then I highly suggest you consider Zenkaiing him because he really, really falls off, starts to really kind of debilitate the team. So yeah, I would definitely suggest that, obviously. I think outside of that change, everything else is the same from the normal difficulty. Raditz is really starting to get his ass kicked, uh, so we are going to have to take a look at that at some point because it is you know, going to be a bit of a hindrance, uh, to be honest with you. Obviously, it is something that does cause us uh, a little bit of pain, <laughs> and, you know, it always tends to. So we are going to have to somewhat manage Raditz a little bit, and we'll have to take a look at that going into the final step. Uh, I think, for me, the big thing is, you know, largely dependent on that extreme slot and this blue Saiyan slot uh, because of the Goku replacing the Bardock things were just way easier now obviously for those who maybe don't know but full power battles are where you select four units you build a team around them make sure all the supports that you use uh, are fully leveled are fully soul boosted and yeah basically you should be really good to go once you are in the actual fight, it works inversely to hyperdimensional carp. So basically you want to wait for the boss's shield to appear. You want to evade his AOE attacks and you want to break that shield by using all out strike, all out key blast, and obviously some rising rush attacks as well. So you want to make sure that you do that. It is the best way to break the boss's skill. Also save your special moves as well, because this will enable you to uh, also you know, cause some significant damage as well. But yeah, that's uh, basically it when it comes to full power battles. Pretty simple stuff. Like I said, um, you know, shouldn't it's a lot is dependent on your units. Like if you have the right battle bonus units, things are very easy. If you don't, then things are very very hard. So if you don't have these units, try and look for alternatives. But always prioritize the battle bonus. It's very very important. And yeah, like I said, if you're gonna use Bardock. Try and Zenkai him if possible. It's probably going to be the best option. But yeah, that's going to be it for me. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like. And I'll see you guys in the next one. So until then, bye.